Hi, my name is Amit Ramani. I'm the founder and uh, CEO of Office. Uh, Office is in the business of providing uh, co-working spaces across India. We are the largest in India today with uh, 25,000 seats across nine cities and across 55 centers. Um, we are obviously uh, already in Hyderabad and our current plans are to expand uh, exponentially in Hyderabad. We started the Hyderabad journey about uh, two years ago. Today we operate about 2,000 seats across four centers. Uh, we are here to announce the expansion into Rayadurg and additional centers at uh, High Tech City, which will take our total seat capacity in the next 60 to 90 days to close to about 5,000 seats, uh, which we again look to double over the next one year to about 10,000 seats by expanding into additional markets such as Begumpet, Financial District and more centers in uh, High Tech City and Gachipauli. Every city has, uh, and every micro market in fact, and every city has a little bit of a different uh, client base that we have. In some locations there's a higher percentage of SMEs that take up space. In some uh, locations there's a combination of uh, corporates, SMEs and startups. So depending on the location, the kind of mix uh, changes. So for example, our centers in Washi, we have a, a lot of KPO clients there. But when we come to a center like Ta Taj Deccan, uh, there are a lot of uh, corporate type clients here as well. So uh, the basic seat comes with uh, tea, coffee, wireless and basic printing included. In addition, we do uh, a lot of different uh, events at all of our centers. Uh, we also have a lot of alliances that we have tied up with which will offer discounts to our committee members and preferential uh, pricing to our community members. Uh, we are also with the largest network of you know, nine cities and 55 centers are able to provide the network effect to people. So people when they travel from let's say Hyderabad to Mumbai, they can on the go move a book a seat or uh, a meeting space so it provides them that uber kind of a feel where they're able to uh, their business on the fly and essentially use the space on the go uh, you know, clearly one is the network effect. With the largest network, you are able to not only space use the space with us in Hyderabad, you can use the space across India, uh, eight additional cities going to, uh, you know, 15 cities. Uh, second, you know, we focus uh, very uh, intrinsically on what we can offer beyond a workspace to our people. So clearly from our side, when we look at the whole real estate space, to us it's our triple E, it's about engagement, enablement and experience. So we do a lot of events, which some could be fun, some could be mentor type events so we bring all that to the table and then ultimately this is a hospitality play I think the kind of service that we offer and the way we take care of our community members I think is way ahead of everybody else and that's why we you know have a community that loves us and community that continues to you know bless us with their um, you know presence and their business. So we'll um, focus it to double capacity. We'll go from roughly 25 to 40,000 seats in the next uh, 12 odd months. Um, then we'll continue the expansion. So from our side, we feel that the depth of the Indian market is so deep that you know the clear um, you know advantage is to continue to provide this in not only tier one cities and the metros, but also go to tier two and three cities in the future. As India expands, we want to be kind of the workspace of choice for uh, the new young age India, and we want to continue to support the expansion of India with providing just-in-time user spaces of our uh, co-working spaces at office. So, uh, with respect to the trend about co-working space, uh, when we started about three to four years, uh, three years back, uh, there were almost about five uh, players and uh, in total would be about seven to eight centers. Right now, uh, there are about 200 to 300 players and the number of centers would be uh, more than, you know, uh, 400 or 500. So, it's interesting uh, that the kind of growth uh, the segment has taken. Co-working has become a mainstream uh, uh, commercial uh, real estate uh, uh, around. Now, just to take an example, uh, let's uh, say uh, it take about five to seven years from black and yellow taxis to migrate to Ola and Uber. It took people about five to seven years. With respect to co-working spaces for SMEs and mid-sized corporates, they are just taking about three years. 
Uh, our growth in the last three years, we have become India's largest uh, co-working player with about 55 centers and 25,000 uh, seats, uh, very clearly testifies that as well. We have uh, six centers in Hyderabad, including the two which we announced uh, today uh, and uh, creating to a total of about 5,000 seats over here. Our seats pricing uh, is from about 5,000 uh, rupees per seat per month to about 10,000 uh, uh, rupees per seat per month. Uh, it varies from product to product. And uh, we also offer uh, daily packages where one can just book a seat from our app on a daily basis at about 350 rupees per day. You can just simply book a meeting room for about 300 bucks an hour. So uh, everyone has a, a you know option available. So uh, we would be having a market share of about uh, 30 to uh, you know 40 percent in the uh, thing because the sector is still evolving. And uh, as I mentioned, it's a, uh, there are about 300 uh, odd players in the market. But sizable, uh, I think there are about five to seven players, and we have a, a very uh, considerable lead uh, than the uh, the second largest player. Uh, see, unlike e-commerce, uh, this uh, this is a brick and mortar uh, service uh, driven and retail business. So uh, what we expect is there would uh, be almost about five or seven players who would uh, thrive and uh, you know uh, capture the uh, larger market share. It's similar to uh, a scenario when one say uh, there would be about five or seven banks in a particular sector. So we expect uh, the competition to be there. And uh, we feel that almost uh, about in about 12 to 18 months when the things uh, cool off, uh, there would be about five or seven large players who would be operating uh, across India. That's a very interesting uh, side with respect to why people are preferring co-working. Uh, for a startups, uh, real estate is a big problem, so it's an obvious choice. Uh, for uh, small and medium enterprises which are operating out of tier 2 spaces, the co-working spaces uh, offer an opportunity to uh, upgrade themselves into a better infrastructure and more premium spaces. With respect to larger corporates, the reason primarily is they are moving their capital expenditure to operating expenditure. Second, uh, with respect to their regional offices, they don't want to go uh, through the process of managing and maintaining the whole show. So it becomes hassle free for them. So that's the reason why we see uh, a lot of business coming from SMEs and uh, larger corporates. So we have a uh, we have a very large presence in uh, Bangalore with about uh, you know 12 centers which are already live. Uh, Chennai is a market which we haven't entered but uh, we intend to uh, set up our first center in the next uh, 60 days. Uh, then apart from uh, these three, uh, we are uh, very actively exploring Vizag uh, as of now. So uh, with respect to our other expansion plans, we are looking to move from about 55 centers and grow to about uh, 90 centers in the next 12 months, uh, taking our seat total to 40,000 from the 25,000 uh, current. So we intend to uh, maintain our leadership position in the sector. Uh, we are also adding more cities. Uh, our new center at Chandigarh is just going live. Uh, we are also tapping new tier 2 cities like Bhubaneswar, Indore and Jaipur.